Hey guys, hi, welcome back. Welcome back to another session here on Terrors and Weeks Row. We are uh, just coming to bring you another message, hopefully encouraging you throughout your day, keeping us empowered and mindful, working at light, staying connected to our love and our joy. Yeah, so how are you guys doing? How are you guys doing? I hope everybody is having a great day again, you know. Just wanted to check in with you guys. And uh, I'm getting ready to pull an empowering question for self. Maybe it's something that will edify you. You can join in in this session and this reading and see if you get something for self. I know y'all keep hearing me sniffling, y'all. I got some sort of sinus or something going on. I'm going to take you on them COVID tests to make sure that, you know, there ain't nothing going on that I'm not aware of, just to make sure I'm aware of what tear is in my field. And we throwing cards on the floor. You know how we do. Welcome. So if this is your first time coming, I am a channel messenger. I do read tarot. I read cards. Spirit may pull me to move, to read from various different texts. I've been a student uh, studying in spirituality in depth um, for uh, just a more fuller knowledge of the most high, our source, uh, what has called our light and everything in the cosmos to be, how we're connected to one another, like how this whole plane works. So, uh, yeah, I've been on that journey for uh, almost 15 to 20 years now, something of the sort. And, uh, yeah, through this uh, journey of enlightenment and, and convening, convening in the spirit, I've always had the ability to uh, see timelines and recognize people uh, that are a part of my life path and life story. And, uh, you know, the tears in my feel, honey, have truly activated me into a different place that I did not know I could go. So we've been working this here gift and digging into it and then serving it out onto you all as I serve onto myself and serve onto other selves. So, yeah, I hope you will stick around and get some edification. And if you like what we're doing, you know, Hit like and, and subscribe to the channel. Share these messages out with others. Yes, thank you, Holy Spirit, for being with us. We call you in right now to convene with us. We ask that the spirit of the infinite intelligence come in and give us messages. Give us our daily dose. Give us our daily bread, right? Give us our portion for the day. Allow us to receive what it is that we need in order to, uh, yeah, Face, face this here day, the unknowns of today. Spirit, you know exactly what's going to be contained here for us, and we need your guidance. Allow us to be strong and obedient as we move through this plane for our highest good. And with that, we have an empowering question. Ooh, look at that, y'all. What larger entity am I a part of? What larger entity am I a part of? You a part of this weak field here, this plane, the most high God, the source material, the cosmos, everything is within you. Oh, goodness, I had to sneeze. Bless me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. What entity, larger entity am I a part of? You are a part of this whole grand system. You are weak, baby. You are called for good bread. Like you didn't know that you was going to be harvested and brought in and made for good bread. That you, you, your source light, you, yes, your unique self is good and edifying to source, onto source itself. Like you just being you and learning and, you know, perfecting and mastering you with your lovely, great self, you know, just letting it unfold and manifest out until it and just it's full of potentiality just really digging into you yes baby you are good for good bread the most high says you are good bread like the it wants to know what you know it wants to experience what you experience i mean of course the most high knows but as you learn and you grow through this thing you know the most high gets to experience that life through you you know we get to Again, we, we call in the spirit of joy. We call in the spirit of might. Let them flex their wings and do their thing. The spirit of intellect giving us those downloads and create creative energies, allowing that intellect to be a manifest, to be to come from the above to the below, to be seen, to be shown in this beautiful plane here. And you are part of that. Yes, you are. You know, you being here in the physical is a part of that. It is the above coming to the below. You come from the above and now you're here in the above below. And there's things that you have inside of you stored up that you need to offer onto the most high God. Yes, yes, yes. 
So where do we go, Spirit? Where would you like to go? Okay. We're going to get some of this here. Starseed Oracle. We were talking about you being a part of a larger entity. Yes, because you were starseed. You were wheat, baby. You were calling for good bread. Yes. Let's, you know, we've been talking about remembering who we are. Who are you? Do you remember? It's time. It's time to remember who you are. We time to remember who you are. You are a child of the most high God. You know, it's time to remember who the tears are. Recognize them, right? So we can be have that situational awareness. Like, what is this situation calling? I feel something down here, spirit. Thank you. This one. No. There we go. The blue flame. What did I say? It's time to do, people. Spirit said, I can't, don't know if y'all can see that. Can y'all get that? Can we get that in there? This little, uh, I don't know. It says spontaneous awakening, activation, integration time. I told y'all we, we've been breaking this here word. Most High says it's time for the week to activate. Get them energy systems in alignment. You know, get them cleared out. Get all that gunk out of there. You know how when you do, when you, you know, that oil in the motors is all thick and, you know, nasty and gunky. It's, you know, it won't let the gears turn over. You know, it's got to be able to move, get that sludge out. Yeah, that's what we're trying to get to, that sludge and that grime and all that nonsense up out of there. You need to be able to get the, get the oil, baby. You need an oil change. Woo, come on, spirit, you are anointed. Did you know that you are the most highest anointed? Maybe you just need an oil change. Get some of that sludge up out of there. Get your gears running all lubed up and turning and yes get fired up we can need to activate spontaneous awakening just wake these people up spirit we got another one spirit said no we done with that that is all to be said it's time to wake up time to activate get all changed baby i'm telling you you guys anointed you are source material you are called for good bread let's get fired up here go on in there and when you do that anoint your own head with oil Bless that oil and put some intention in on t intention on it, some focus. You know, you know, I make my own oil blend up. You can do the same. You know, bless it. Put some intention on there. I tell myself every day when I'm oil in my head, it's it is steamed in the shower. You see my Bob Marley's all curled up. It's steamed in the shower every day. We gotta get that moisture, get some flow. You know what I'm saying? You yes, I'm you know, I'm excited. I'm excited over here. Come on, Spirit, pull me back. You know how we get. We get to go on. We ready to activate. We got to get fired up. Get them engines moving. You need an oil change. Anoint your hair with oil every day. Anoint that hair with oil. Your cup runneth over. Put that intention on your own oil, baby. Who says you can't anoint yourself? You got the power. Come on now, wake up. Spontaneous awakening. Activation integration time we calling all the wheat to the field you know we waking this wheat field up you know we stirring the spirit is coming through he rustling the field now let's go where you want to go to now spirit okay spirit says love baby love is what the, the answer the key loving on each other loving on you loving on you loving on you i love on me so i can love on you that's why i tell y'all all the time i love y'all like i love me and i love me I love me because I love the most high and the most high called me. So I, you know, I had to recognize who I am. You know, I'm a whole star seed out here. I'm a child of the most high God. Like I'm the light that he called to be. You know, we, we, we called onto this thing here. We, we come to serve. I volunteered to be here. You know, we may not remember that you volunteered to be here in the spirit before the above touch the below you know we come in as infants we don't remember all that you know that's right you know the prophetess prophetess of the sacred way do you know who you are are you a prophetess are you supposed to speak the word to the people are you supposed to tell the we feel it's time to activate are you supposed to talk to the members of your family and say hey we need to come together hey this is not high vibrational we need to learn how to love each other better we need to put to the bed these generational curses we need to pull this stuff out and root it out you know our roots are rotten we got root rot down in here we need to lift ourselves up out of this nastiness out of this sludge we need to get a new anointing on the people. Wake up, people. Wake up, we. How y'all doing? I love y'all. Let's go.
I'm with you. You are not by yourself. You are not by yourself. You are not by yourself. My heart is the compass. The path of love is true abundance. Yes, we are abundant. How can a whole wheat field not be abundant? You make bread. That is abundance, baby. We always talking about getting a bread. You know, fuck a bag. We making bread all day. I don't know what you got in your bag. Shit, I don't know what you put in that bag. I know what bread is, though. And I can see the bread. And I can see if it's good bread or not bread. Do it got mold on it? Is it fucked up? Is it scale? Is it crusty? You know, uh, stale and crusty. You know, is it hard? Is it soft? Is it moist? Is it good bread? You know, can I touch it? I don't want to mess with your bag. I don't know what's in that bag. Could be a bag of tricks. I don't want that bag. I want some bread. I want some good bread. That's what I'm talking about. Let's do it. Let's do it, people. Come on, spirit, with the love. What do we need to bring? Because love is the way. Love is, is not an emotion. It's how we express compassion, empathy, sympathy, understanding, patience, right? Giving on to others, which you would have given on to self. That's how we love each other. Forgiveness. Right? Let it go. Get that sludge out of there. Forgiveness is for you, baby, not for them. Come on, spirit. What is it that we feeling? I felt it. Yeah. The emperor is a protection. Come on now. I am safe and divinely protected. I am held at all love all, all times. That's what we're talking about, people. That's what we're talking about, we. We're talking about holding on to your love at all times, no matter what the tear is. It doesn't matter. We, we, we move in those expressions of love and sympathy and empathy first, understanding that we are all called and we all going through this here process, cycling through this process here. We learning. We on a learning journey. And as we're learning, we understand that we are going to make mistakes. And as I make mistakes and you make mistakes, I, can, I recognize if I make them, you make them. So I can give you a measure of compassion, compassion and empathy and sympathy because I can give that same measure to self. If I can understand it for me, how can it not be for you? You are me. I'm you. We're reflections of each other. You know, we're connected, baby. We we. Yes, I'm in held in love at all times. I am safe and divinely protected. You got to know that the most high has you, that you walk with the kingdom of on the inside, you walk with spirits of protection on the inside. Are you activating them? Are you calling them into activation at the start of your day? You know, hey, we need you to go forth before me and protect me from all dangers seen and unseen, known and unknown. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. I gird myself in thee. I got the breastplate on. I got the helmet on. I got the, the sword of truth right here. And God watching my back, I don't even turn around because I got the legion with me. They're going to clean all that up. I keep my eyes forward, pressed on the mark, hands on the plow, keep going. You do this work here. You just keep following what the Most High tells you. Do it in love and light, you know, lightheartedness, forgiveness, letting things go. As you rise with this new day, this new opportunity, baby, it's time to do it. That old stuff, let it fall, fall and pass away. Let yourself be renewed in this day. Let your spirit be renewed. Come on, spirit. Thank you so much. I'll be getting hype. I can't, you know, I'll be getting hype. Thank you. Yes, I feel it. It's somewhere right in here. Oh. What is it? What is it? What is it? Oh, my Bago, the warrior saint. I am a warrior of love. My devotion attracts resources and support. Come on, Holy Spirit. Tell the people what you need them to know. How we get this in here so that they could see it. You know what I'm saying? This light just be. Is that good? Can y'all see that? The warrior saint. Absolutely. I am a warrior of love. I use my love. That's what we were just talking about. Put the shield on. I got a sword on. Spirit came through and said that. Come on now, we ain't playing with this here thing. This is for real. This is real, folks. This is not for game. This ain't for play play. We ain't got no games about this. We real about this all day, every day. 
We real. We weak. We 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 the real baby. We ain't no tears. This ain't no copycat. This ain't no doppelganger effect. We real with this here. Come on, spirit, and tell them who we are. We are a warrior saint. You are a warrior of love. My devotion attracts resources and support. Keep your hand to the plow. Stay devoted to what the Most High told you to do. You keep looking straight. You keep. That's right. Move forward in everything that you need. All your resources, all your support, all your help will be called in, brought to you on a daily basis. On a daily basis. Get up and ask the Most High for your daily portion. It's there. Don't leave nothing on the table every day. Go for it every day. Use every little bit that you can get in there. You squeeze it in there. Everything that the most I give you, you find a way to organize it. Even if you can't do nothing with it right now, write it down. Don't let it go to waste. Write it down. Divine timing will happen. It'll, it'll come through when it's supposed to come through. Come on, Holy Spirit, because I felt that goddess of abundance, baby. Come on now, Spirit says. Can y'all see that? Gosh darn it. There's light. I cannot... Holy Spirit, help me figure out what the, what is the angle for this here. That look that look better. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you, thank you. Lakshmi, Lakshmi, the goddess of abundance. I choose to feel abundant. Wealth is an inside job. That's right. It's on the inside of you. It's on the inside of you. Look at this, Lilith, the first woman. I am the voice of my body and soul. I choose to the life that I choose the life that i desire to live you gotta choose this thing we you gotta choose to call your portion in every day you gotta choose your portion you don't leave it on the table nobody could take your portion from you unless you relinquish it sacrifice on it walk away from it give it up the only way that you could lose your portion is if you give up if you give up on you if you relinquish it if you sacrifice it right no even if somebody think that they done got your physicality what they have with like they think they didn't it's coming back it's coming back because it belongs to you you did go forward and claim your shit yeah Nick, you think you got it no you don't uh as i'm walking away i'm claiming it and this is trickling it's following right behind me i ain't even got to turn around and look at it because i know it's coming i know that the most high is bringing back to me what i was old i know it is i know I don't have no doubt about it, baby. And whatever I don't have, I don't need. I count it to none. It's good. Because look, huh, do I look, I'm not missing nothing. Not a beat. Walked away from a whole life and don't miss a beat. That's what you do when you walk in the spirit. It will tell you, it, you everything that you need is in the spirit. You don't need that stuff. Count it to not. You don't need that. You got everything that you need right with you. A whole universe. Of material source material that you can will why because you the alchemist and you use your love and light to manifest anything baby why because you the weak playfulness is a spiritual power laughter leads me back to the light lalita i haven't pulled her before but she's really pretty too you know guys and see if i can get that where you can see her uh like we talked about laughing because it's shitty, uh, just laughing at life, that innocence, childlike spirit, being playful, right? Laughter leads you back to light, absolutely, because as soon as you start laughing, that lightheartedness starts to come in. You release, you release a piece of the pain, right? Every laugh, you release in peace and chunks of pain. Get them out right break it up that sludge again get that sludge out so you can get a fresh new anointing be re-oiled and lubricated so that you can get those gears going you can create from a space of love and light yes yes my ego is in service of my soul and i trust my soul's divine time queen esther the morning star are you the star of the morning? Are you breaking the light of the day? Are you are you ushering in the day? Activate first thing in the day. Let's do it, people. It's time to activate. It's time to activate. Where are we going? Okay. This right here is the work your light oracle. That's right. Because we know we have to use love, right? Love. 
is how we work our life, those expressions, that empathy, again, empathy, empathy, people, empathy, empathy onto self, empathy onto others, understanding that we are connected, we are going through this here, walk together, we're learning and growing together. Yes, we're going to offend and, and, and impede, in, impose upon each other and understanding that we ourselves are not perfect, right? We are all going through this walk and we have give empathy and release and let it go. Forgiveness, not saying that what they did was right. No, it's not right, but you still have to let go and forgive for self so that you can open up. You can bring the most high into those spaces where you're not holding on to bitterness and getting that root right. We can't let your roots rot, baby. You can't be good bread with rotted roots. I'm just saying. I need you to come on, spirit. Spirit says, you're already doing it, but it was in reverse. So maybe you're not doing it. You know, maybe you're not, maybe you're not really releasing. Stop overthinking. Keep facing your true north. Again, find out your north node, baby. Where you heading to? You know, what is the practice and the lesson of this lifetime of this manifestation? Where did you come from in terms of energy? You know, if, if I was Aries, in, in my past, you know, and I'm, I'm heading to Libra, you know, I know that I'm coming from a place that, you know, with these particular characteristics, maybe I was focused on self, maybe, you know, and I've got to move to balance. Maybe I was all about work and, and no play. Maybe I didn't have enough time for the most high and seeing balance in nature. You know, maybe that's my goal this time. Again, mirror who or what is triggering you. Find out what it is. After that, we had deep cellular healing and transformation. When you see what's triggering you, you can heal it. You can release it. You can let it go. Call in forgiveness, right? Get to the point where you can be unbiased by it. Like, I may not, you know, I don't even care. I'm like that, like that, that point, you know, it's like, I, you know, it's, it's of no consequence because I'm so focused on me awakening we got that again baby we had that other card when i say energetic upgrades a new way of being integration come on through holy spirit we had the blue flame earlier here what does that say it says spontaneous awakening activation integration time we in a whole nother deck baby it says energetic energetic upgrades a new way of being integration we pulled a card earlier today for rebirth and renewal it is a new time. It is a new way of being. It's time for us to integrate. It's time for the week to come together, the sheep to come to the sheepfold. Master is calling us. It's time to come on the porch. I mean, the lights is, is getting dark, baby. Street lights is coming on. We need to come inside. Come inside. Come inside. Come inside. Spirit said, where's the other half of my deck? And I got excited. Write a passage. The initiation crossing the threshold. I just said, come inside, cross the threshold. Empaths, highly sensitive, connect with nature, get grounded, get grounded, connect with your source, people, connect with your source. Go outside and walk a foot in the grass, splash around in the puddle. When was the last time you went outside? And, you know, I know you probably don't want to get your hair wet, but, you know, take the umbrella and go outside and. And, and just take your shoes off with the umbrella and walk in the rain. See, don't that make you feel like a kid again? And splash in a puddle. Come on now. Who says you had to, to, to give up your childlike spirit? These tears, that's a lie. You keep your spirit through the tears. That's the test. And what are we going to do? We're going to go from tear to testimony. That's right. We do it. We go from tear to testimony, holding on to that love, holding on to a childlike spirit, understanding that forgiveness is for us. We get that sludge out, that dirt out, all that nasty, gunky oil that's got your gears all clogged up. You can't get going. You can't activate. You can't get running smoothly. Every time you feel like you get going, it's hesitating and putting and stuttering and stalling out. No, get that gut sludge out of there. Get an oil change. Oil change, baby. Re-anoint yourself. I'll anoint you, yes, with the blessing of the Lord. Put that oil on you. You know we oil ourselves down every day. I don't know. I'm saying 
Everybody put some oils and moisturize it all and put some intention in there. I don't care what it is you're putting on there. Put some intention in it before you put it on it. That's what spirit said. Put some intention in it before you put it on it. There you go. Bless yourself with everything before you put your clothes on. Bless them. Let me walk in righteousness today for righteousness sake. Let me cl be clothed in righteousness today. Put it in your intention and in everything. You wield everything. All of this source material is all made from the same stuff, baby. All of it. This shirt, this mic, this phone, all of it made from the same source. I command and claim everything. The Most High says we're here to dominate. Who says you can't dominate that fit you got on? That it ain't going to shield you and block you off from that, that negativity. Them, them cackling ass crones that's kicking over there in them corner. Them hating ass me, whatever, you know, that's over there looking like he thank he and whatever and trying to get what you got because they think you do. You know what I mean? How I go? Y'all know. Clothe yourself. Gird yourself. In the most high. He's with you. The spirit is with you at all times. Activate people. Time to come together. Come together with you, with self, your spiritual team. Come together with all of us in the we feel for that support and that connectivity. We need to get to the next level. It's time to do it, baby. I don't know if y'all hyped up for the rest of this here day, but I show him. I'm fired up. I done called in my portion. It is time to get it. I ain't leaving nothing on the table today. I don't know about y'all, but I want it all. I want every last crumb. I'm sweeping up afterward. And I, I, I ain't leaving them nothing. I ain't leaving nothing. I want all man, all man, all man. Give them here. Give them here. All man. All, all, all. Give it, give it, give it. Don't speak against yourself. Don't push nothing back. Believe on you. Every time you that doubt come up through the day, baby, I, nope, I believe on my, I, I'm believing on the most high. I believe it. I believe it. I believe it. Don't matter. Kids have an amazing imagination. You'd be wondering how they believe such shit. Yeah. Yeah. Get that kid like spirit, that innocent mindset. Believe it. Believe more on you than a doubt. Believe more on you than what the world says about you. Believe more on the most high and who he says he is and what he will do in you and through you than what the world says you cannot do. Be ye not to conform to the world, not in your mind, not in your spirit, not in your vessel, nothing. Be you a unique expression of the most high God, knowing that you have everything, everything within you to be everything that you are called to be. And who are you called to be? The wheat, baby. And you are called for good bread. Until the next time, y'all. I love y'all. I love y'all so much. I love you the way that I love me. Yes, I do. And I love me because I love the most high. And I can't get there without y'all. I need y'all. I need every last one of y'all. Come on in. It's time to come in. It's time. The street lights is on, y'all. It's time to come in. Until next time, I shall.